Hey guys, I'm SKV and you're watching SKV Plays On and welcome to another gameplay of Assassin's Creed Origins. And we're gonna be talking about the dual blades which we get from the Hidden Ones DLC which is the blades of Toth. I'll be simply starting off with how to get them. First of all, we need to be in the northern region of Sinai. Sinai is the new map for the Hidden Ones DLC. The place is Arisno Nome. As soon as you go to the north of Sinai in Arisno Nome, you're gonna find a temple called Temple of Thot or Thoth, however you pronounce it. Uh, it is T H O T H. Once you're here, you're gonna find a huge tree. The tree you can check it out. I'm gonna use Senu right now to show you guys how big the tree is. It's pretty big. You can't even see what's down there once you get on top. But this tree is so huge it has huge roots at the bottom and these roots on one side is covering up a door. If you can see right through the roots right there, there's something shining inside and that's a crystal. What you need to do is get that crystal. So to get the crystal you need to break the roots. Once you're done with breaking the roots you can go to the door and pick up the crystal like so. And now you know that we have to use the crystal to go to the top of the obelisk. The thing which we're looking at up there is the obelisk. Just go climb up, use your parkouring skills with Bayek right now and take that crystal right on top of that place. Right now I'm just taking my own time showing you guys a little bit of uh, climbing skills from Bayek and also showing you guys what you can see on the obelisk. You can see that it's pretty well detailed this time as well. The hidden ones have been pretty well detailed. Once you reach the top, you're gonna find this. And once you get the option to place it, like so, and that's what happens. You're gonna find two light rays going right through the top of that obelisk and to the mirrors downstairs and instantly you have to go down make sure you use those mirrors in a specific way which I'll show you right now let me just get down oh boy and I'll do that roll and then we're going to the mirror right now and to show you what I'm supposed to do make sure you burn out those webs on those uh, mirrors over here on those statues the huge statues you can see some mirror plates on top once you're done with that use these stationary mirrors here and the light rays that is hitting it and reflect it towards that mirror you see what i mean and you need to point it in such a way that it's exactly reflecting the ray of light coming from the top of the obelisk and hitting the door from where you got the crystal as you can see it's hitting the door and now we go to the other side where there's another mirror which is stationary so we use that light ray reflect it using the other stationary statue mirror there and voila open says me hello kitty anyways now that the door is open what do you think you're gonna do Duh, of course you're gonna go towards the door. And now we are near the door. Ooh, what was that voice? It's nothing, just jump in. There's no voices in there. Don't be scared, go down. There's like a little good bayek. Okay, keep going, keep going. And boom. That's it. And that's how you get those two new dual blades. Made of the strongest iron, and have not rusted in all the ages spent under this tree. As he said, these are some crazy dual blades which are, which are not rustable at all. And you got them. Check it out. Oh man, I love these dual blades. 
and ba-boom we got a level 43 jewel blades and of course if you're wondering uh, why it's locked it's because you have to be level 43 plus to actually use these dual blades these are really good dual blades and that's how you get them from this hidden ones dlc you do need to have the main game as well to actually be able to play the hidden ones dlc when you get it but that's how you get these two dual blades these are pretty awesome dual blades if i say so myself and you can also get out of this temple through this small passageway and you're out that's about it how to get the two blades called the blades of thought or thought or thought or whatever it is i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i also hope you guys enjoyed the small gameplay on how to get the dual blades and thanks for watching and until next time Keep smiling and uh, oh yeah, see ya.